Ever wondered how devices in private network reaches the internet? Let's understand this. So devices located in private network has private IP address. And to reach the internet, it requires public IP address. So for that, it uses NAT, that is called as network address translations, in which private IP addresses will be mapped with public IP addresses to reach the internet. Under this NAT, we have different methods like static NAT, dynamic NAT, and PAC, that is called as a port address translations. So static NAT involves one-to-one -one mapping where one private IP addresses will be mapped with a single public IP addresses to reach the internet. So this static NAT is preferred or it is perfect for the web hosting or we can say like a web servers or email servers examples. So for the static NAT, we give commands IP NAT inside source static and then followed by we give here source IP that is going to be the private IP followed with the public IP addresses. So this is about the static NAT. In the next video, I will discuss about dynamic NAND and PAC. So stay tuned for upcoming technical videos. Thank you.